Hi there, this is Dr. Anton from Johannesburg, South Africa. This video is going to be my rapid fire version of how to protect yourself against viruses, specifically for travelers, because people are still contacting me about their stress uh, because of the travels that they are going to go on. So this video is going to contain everything that you'll see in my longer video. So just look in the description below for the link to the longer video. What this video does contain that I didn't speak about in the longer video is how a surgical mask is not going to give you the protection that you think. Now in South Africa, surgical masks are completely sold out. You cannot find a single surgical mask at any pharmacy, but it's not going to provide the protection that you think. Enjoy the video. Okay, so let's look at the top three ways that I protect myself when I'm traveling. Just take note that these three are part of a longer video on how to deal with viral infections. I will put the link in the description below where you can have a look at it. Right, the first thing, wash your hands. Travel with this. Travel with a waterless hand cleaner. You can choose whatever brand you like. I like this one because it makes a foam. But clean your hands regularly. When the aerostase gives you something, she obviously gave someone else something down the aisle. Make sure that you clean your hands on a regular basis through your flight. And this is a proven way to prevent viral infections in any human being. The second thing I do when I'm traveling is to always have my colloidal silver with me. Now, colloidal silver, you can buy at most pharmacies in South Africa. I think anywhere in the world, you will find colloidal silver. Um, and I buy these empty bottles at my pharmacy and I add colloidal silver to the empty bottle. I've got one in my main luggage and I've got one in my hand luggage. And I just spray my mouth and my throat on a regular basis throughout the flight, before, during the flight and after. And this is a proven, this good science on colloidal silver, how it kills viruses and bacteria. It is safe unless you start drinking a liter of this stuff every day, then you can develop a condition where your skin turns blue. The condition is called argaria. So this is my second big tip, have colloidal silver on hand while you travel. My third tip is about water. You need to drink more water on an airplane than what you're used to. The reason for this is that airplanes have a low humidity environment inside. You've got humidity of about 10 to 20 percent. Um, in a room, you would have anywhere from 30 to 40 percent humidity. So drink enough water, drink enough that you actually have to go and pee every three hours. Now this is going to serve another purpose, it's going to get you out of your chair. I noticed that people sit way too long when they're on international flights, and that's not good for you. It increases your risk for deep vein thrombosis, um, especially if you're taking a contraceptive, ladies. Um, and if you co combine the dehydration with the sitting, then your risk for deep vein thrombosis goes up even more. But obviously now when it comes to viruses, having hydrated mucous membranes just increases your resilience to actually getting a viral infection. So drink enough water. Finally, I just want to say something about surgical masks. Someone contacted me yesterday quite stressed because they, they're going to fly and they can't buy a surgical masks because they sold out everywhere in South Africa. Now, a surgical mask is not the first route of protection against viral infections. Because remember now, the surgical mask doesn't seal. It's not a respirator. Um, if you want to have real protection, you would have to have a real proper rest, medical respirator that forces the air to go through the respirator. Maybe the surgical mask will provide some protection that when you accidentally touch your face after shaking someone's hand, maybe there's some level of protection there. But then you would have to do that every single time you fly for the rest of your life. Because remember now, the common flu, the annual flu, kills more people than, than these virus scares. So follow my three tips that I gave today to protect yourself against viral infections. I trust that this video was useful and especially for our regular travelers that it provided you some calm with regards to viral infections. Um, you can look in the description below. I've added the full link to the longer video that looks at viral infections and how to boost the immune system. Please like, share, subscribe to my channel. And uh, for those of you that want other topics to be discussed, just add them in the comments below. This is Dr. Anton from Johannesburg.